This is going to be fun. In this video, I'm showing you how we are replacing myself with an AI version of myself to create video content. Because honestly, I got a newborn, I got a family, I got three businesses. Creating video is a lot of work. And there is technology out right now that is allowing me to not have to create video ever again. In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how I'm doing it. Let's get it. So I want to start by showing you a completed video that the AI generated. Now, keep in mind, this is not perfect by any means. Uh, I wouldn't use this for videos longer than 30 seconds to a minute. I wouldn't use it to replace videos like this because there's certain things that the AI is not quite there yet. And I say yet because I got to be honest, this is the first time that AI has really blown me away and been like, hey, it's coming and it's coming very soon in the next six to 12 months, 24 months, this type of video is going to be everywhere. And I think it's important that you at least try and get ahead of it a little bit. And what I really like about this too, which we'll talk about, is that there's still barriers to entry. It's not as simple as just, you know, creating an avatar off of an image or a simple video. So let's play this video. You can take a quick look. You are looking at the lead generation dashboard from Madison Law, an injury firm in Georgia. You can see he got 96 phone calls last month, which is up 433% since last year. We got these results in just 90 days from making one simple change to his marketing strategy. I put together a quick video walking you through exactly what we did and how you can do it too. Hit the link below and I will see you on the next page. So that is AI, Ryan. Now, you'll notice some things. It's a little bit monotone. The voice is a little bit off. But what we did is we fed it to the AI, which I'm going to show you in a second exactly how we did it step by step. But we also then post edited it. We put some music behind it to kind of fix it, the voice a little bit. And we added some B-roll. And this is just kind of a cheap edit that I did. I actually haven't even passed this to my professional editing team yet, who's going to add text on top, just things to kind of distract the, the watcher from this a little bit and kind of call away from the fact that my voice might be a little bit off, might be a little bit monotone, my lips might be a little bit off, and I'm tr trying to talk into it as well. But overall, it's pretty damn good. It looks just like me. I've actually tested by sending this to friends um, by making them kind of like personalized videos. And they're like, did you really just film a professional video saying hi to me? A lot of people haven't noticed. And that's kind of the key thing here. We're going to use this as ads. We're going to test running different hooks, different pieces of creative using this kind of setting and just testing to see how it does. Because you might know because I'm telling you that this is AI, but if you're scrolling down your feed on your mobile phone, small, you might not notice, especially if your volume's off. So in terms of how we're doing this, we're using a platform called HeyGen, it's HeyGen.com. Uh, I saw somebody posting about it and I decided to check it out. So what's cool about this is it allows you to create your own video avatar. Now, like I said, what I really like about this is that anyone can do this, but the requirements to get the right type of video into the AI is gonna stop this from being anybody able to use this right now. Now, of course, um, we all have 4K video on our phones, but it's just not that simple. You need professional lighting. Uh, you need good quality audio with a professional microphone. Otherwise, it just won't really work out well when you feed it to it. So I'm gonna show you the actual video that I fed it because this is from a professional filming that I sat down and did. So this is the... original video that I sent it, you can see it looks exactly the same. So what we did here is put some studio lighting up. You can actually see them in the background, a couple of 4K cameras, professional microphone and record it. Now, when I recorded this at the time, I didn't know that I was gonna be feeding the AI with it, but I ended up feeding it to it. And this is what ended up coming out. Welcome to the new era of video creation with HeyGen. Simply type your script to get started. It's pretty crazy, right? <laughs> That's pretty damn crazy. And then you just create with studio and you can come in here and you can type in whatever you want. Hi, YouTubers. Play it back, see how it sounds. And it doesn't always sound great, um, like I said, and there's certain words that you'll probably want to stay away from Hi, as YouTubers. well that might not be natural or organic to somebody talking about this, but you can literally see from a, a pure studio shot point of view, it is, it's the exact same. <laughs> it looks exactly how we filmed it. Now, I also fed it uh, some green screen because when they give you instructions here on how to set up um, 
your own avatar. This is the, I, I filmed on a green screen as well with a friend of mine, same guy who filmed the other one. And uh, you just basically just film a two minute video of you talking, right? Uh, and then you literally take that video and you can create an avatar and you just upload it directly in here, right? So you just upload the footage that you have. So the two footages that I uploaded, this is the green screen one. Hey Ryan, your instant avatar is ready. Feel free to create videos with it. Also click the feedback button to share what you think. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> my, my eyes getting a little bit wonky. I don't know what I'm looking at. I'm like my, my newborn son, just eyes going all over the place. Um, but you can see it's, it's not quite as good. But this one came out really good. And that's because like we really took the time to film it properly. So what I do like about this, like I said, is that for right now anyways, there's some barriers to enter around this because the problem with this type of technology is that once anybody can use it, it's just gonna get overrun. Nobody's gonna pay attention to it. And I actually think what's gonna happen in the not so distant future is that when people see professional shots like this or when they see shots like this, they're just going to ignore it because they're not going to be able to decipher whether it's AI or not. So what I think is going to be the most impactful video, ironically, in the next year and probably going forward is the most native, dirty, natural looking video filmed right from a cell phone, because that is what people are going to know is you know, natural and not AI generated. Now, what's cool about this is that there's a couple of use cases for it. So like I said, we're currently testing this with ads. I'm going to create another video and actually show you how it's coming out off the back end of it. Um, but there's abilities in here to create different types of videos. AI hey, Studio, I'm not exactly sure where it is. I haven't dug in here too much. But in terms of other use cases for this, um, let me actually send you this, show you this email that I sent out today to my email list of law firms. So video is tough to create. Um, and, you know, those who follow my channel know that I'm an SEO at the core and what's happening with Google right now is they are demoting traditional content listings, blog content. You should see all the freaking travel bloggers crying on Twitter. It's so sad. Um, affiliates, they're just getting pushed down because Google knows that it's crap content. Written word has been commoditized next to just down to nothing. And it's not valuable for people anymore. People, searchers don't want to see it. Now, what's still very valuable is video. And that's because again, there's higher barriers to entry to it. YouTube is the number two search search engine on the planet. There's a ton of value in being able to create video content, but the reason why it's still valuable is because not as many people can just come in and write. Not as many tools can come in and write. You have to actually get on a camera and create, and you have to know what you're doing as well on top of that. So that creates barriers to entry, which creates less competition, which creates more visibility and more opportunity. Now, with law firms, which is what our agency specializes in working, only 8% of lawyers create video content because they're so busy, they don't have the resources, it's a huge pain for them to do it. But for this, for you to be able to sit down, put a 4K camera in their face and just tell them to talk for two minutes and then create all the scripts and just have an AI do it is very, very interesting. Very interesting because they're also not marketers. So this type of technology probably won't take off like it's gonna take off in our industry uh, unless agencies push it. So I sent out this email today um, that just kind of digs into that, talking about how, you know, video is really important. You should be sending out more of a blah, blah, blah. So um, what we're doing is for some of our top tier clients, the ones that are paying us, you know, 15 k or more, we're flying down to Miami. I'm setting them up with our video guy uh, in, a, in a studio, just like I shot here. And we're going to film them and we're going to film them in multiple locations too. So this shot here, right? My fear here too, is that people are just gonna get blindness to seeing me sitting in the same shot too. So we're gonna shoot them in different locations, five different locations, talk here for two minutes, talk here for two minutes, uh, talk here, sitting on top of a desk, you know, uh, standing in an office space. So that way there's kind of different vibes that we can create and we can basically probably create like a year's worth of content from 10 minutes worth of filming, think about that. So we're testing this with a couple of our clients. Again, I'm gonna create more content around this so you can see how it goes, um, but it's completely hands off because then we can literally feed chat GPT scripts. We can just do our kind of normal content process. We can write scripts and then feed it directly to this platform, have it create the videos on the back end. Now, again, I wouldn't do this for my channel because you all are marketers out there and you're not gonna sit there and watch an AI, but for personal injury clients who got hurt on the job and don't know what to do. They got hit in the back of the head by scaffolding, walking through New York City and they're searching YouTube or Google for this or they're on TikTok, they're watching a short video. And again, when you combine this with post editing and B-roll, right? 
if it's a couple of long minute video and it's purely informational based, it's just a different way to consume. And if it looks real and the information is good, it's an opportunity to make some money here, people. So I sent this out and I basically, you know, was asking people if they wanted to see um, what it looks like and I'll just show you. I actually just sent them the, the, the video that I just sent to you, that I showed you the of the, of the ad. So that's what we're doing right now. Um, pretty exciting stuff. I mean, for me anyways, I showed this to my wife and she could not give less of a shit. She thought it was stupid. Um, but I just wanted to share this with you guys because not like I'm going to be creating this on my channel nonstop, but I do think that this is very interesting and I'm going to keep you guys in check with how things are going, with how it's going with our ads, with how it's going with clients. Um, so just drop me a comment below if you want to see more of these videos. And if so, then I'll create more. Uh, if not, as always, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.